The famous French gastronome, Brie Savarin, dubbed the truffle the black diamond of the kitchen. At prices which tend to hover around 1,000 to 1,500 euros a kilo, this seems a very apt description. This festival attracts all the local producers, mainly of truffle-related fare, including a truffle aperitif and scrambled eggs with truffles prepared before your very eyes. We came here pre-COVID with a group of close friends and we watched the truffle hunting competition. To be honest, the performance of the dogs was somewhat underwhelming. Not only did they seem to want a treat before finding a truffle, but they sometimes seemed quite dazed and confused. The pig, however, the sow, for whom the smell of truffle resembles that of a rutting boar, gave a masterclass in this ancient skill. This 140 kilo specimen homed in every time, no hesitation at all. Oh, isn't she cute? Sadly, this year with COVID, the Ops Festival was cancelled. However, now in semi-lockdown with a 6pm curfew, we were able to visit a nearby village, staging a one-off local produce market. Although not truffle specific, the producers did have a stand and we were able to buy one. I think I know what Narelle may want to do with them. And I hope I'm right. Hi, Narelle here from Food Sale Love and welcome back to my lockdown kitchen in the south of France. And this is the truffle I bought yesterday. Oh, and it smells extraordinary. I left it in with the eggs overnight to absorb those fabulous aromas. And now I thought I'd make something really simple, but so delicious, scrambled eggs with truffles. So let's start by scrambling the eggs. Yes. I'll put my truffle aside and then start cracking my beautifully fresh organic eggs. Truffle should be used on foods with simple flavours, pasta, rice, or in our case today, eggs, so we don't upstage the magnificent flavour of the truffle. Now we'll add a little salt, a little pepper, and just gently whip them together. Now into a warm pan, you put a good knob of butter. Now the golden rule in making scrambled eggs is that you can't rush it and it must never be on too hot a flame. I have a diffuser underneath my pan and traditionally in France they used to use a bain-marie and cook it really very slowly. So you can cook it directly on the heat but it just has to be gentle. So while the butter's melting I'll grate a little bit of the truffle into the egg mix. So now that the butter's melted and warm, we're going to pour in our eggs. Okay. And just constantly but gently stir. If it gets too hot, which means it starts to catch, just simply take it off for a minute. Now I can feel that it's starting to really cook and be almost ready. We like them quite runny here and not rubbery at all. So that's just about ready. Now I'm going to turn off the heat and add some cream and that will stop the cooking. And I think that's just about perfect. So turn off the heat. We'll add our cream. And they're beautifully velvety and unctuous, just as we like it. 
Okay. A little butter. Oh, and now the eggs. Ready? can't find my truffle slicer so I'm using my grater again just to finish off how decadent is that the topping of fresh truffles okay let's eat cameraman Atal. well scrambled eggs and truffles brouillade au truffes yep it's quite a lockdown treat and um Look, this is wonderful for brunch or lunch, but in our case, an early Sunday supper. And of course, washed down with a few bubbles, can't be all bad. So cheers. Cheers, and, my love. Uh, bon appétit. Thank you. Mm. Scrambled eggs are one of my favorite things on the planet, but enhanced with, um, with truffles, that really puts the cream on the top. Mm. And this is absolutely delicious. Absolutely That's, um, delicious. Scrambled eggs to a whole new level, doesn't it? <laughs> and they deserve it. They and certainly they deserve do. It. They certainly do. Cheers, my love, and thank Cheers. you very much. It's You're lovely. welcome. Cheers, everybody. Cheers. Stay Good well. health, everybody.